YouTubers, Mike Martin's here, Mike Martin's channel. Uh, just an update on the Vancouver housing crisis. I found this, this fell from the heavens. It's conspiracy paper, it's not even real. It's printed on marijuana paper too. So this is 100% fake. It's not real. What I'm reading here is not real. This is an illusion. I'm creating this out of thin air. And let me read what it says here. For all those that are having some sort of a problem admitting this, like uh, Mark Chu, who keeps chewing me out, and jo Jonathan Lee, who keeps commenting on my weight and just bashing me. Well, I'm going to read this from the um, Vancouver Courier here. It's page A20. It's a conspiracy paper, by the way. Uh, the average detached home price fell about 16% in August. Okay. Detached home prices dropped sharply. An average detached home prices in, in Metro Vancouver fell dr dramatically in August. In the last largest uh, monthly price drop in recognition in, in region's recent history. Sorry, I can't read. According to the numbers released Friday by the Real Estate Board of Greater Vancouver, REBGV in brackets, the average detached home fell almost 300,000, more than 16% drop. Putting, putting it to 1.4 million from 1.76 million. Sales have been trending downward in Metro Vancouver for a few months. President Dan Morrison in a press release, the new foreign, the new foreign buyer tax appears to have added to this trend and reducing foreign buyers activity and causing some uncertainty against local home buyers and sellers. August housing sales in the region were 3.5% below the month's 10-year sales average. New listings during the month totaled 4,293 4, in August compared to 5,241 in July, the drop of 18%. As for, uh, for uh, other real estate uh, clashes, apartments and attached homes had a large average, average percentage decline. So it just goes on to say that... Uh, Prices are are are, uh, are 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 dropping, and I'm gonna have when 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 there's a huge crash, I'm gonna have a huge huge party. I mean, I'm gonna have a DJ, speakers, music, because if the attitude of the people that bought into the market and that are basically mad at the guy who brings the messenger or blames the guy who. Um, who's reading and bringing, making up these conspiracies. So I just wanted to throw this out there. And um, it's a really good article. So so the average 700 under a million dollar house fell from, so apartment prices fell 8% points from 573 to 528. That's for a one bedroom. And the average attached home or townhouse fell 7% 7 from 730 uh, to 798. So not only are sales going down, but the average price of um, housing is going down now too. So my videos were about, my first original five, six videos were just about the sales, the decline in sales. I never spoke about how prices are plummeting. I'm talking about how sales went down 80%, right? Now this is stating that prices are going down. Wow, and this is, this is beautiful. I'm gonna have like a huge party with DJs. I'm gonna cater some food. I'm gonna buy a couple of thousand bucks in food. And uh, when the crash happens, it's going to be beautiful. I'm going to invite, uh, because where I live in this complex, these are all three bedroom, um, um, it's, a, it's a company that rents these out. 
Uh, majority of the people here are business owners, uh, Canadian Canadian business owners. A lot of a um, couple of really cool Hispanic people here. I talk Spanish to all the time. I love practicing my Spanish. Uh, one guy owns a, a big cleaning. He's a big. He owns a big cleaning company with about 70 employees. Really good guy. Uh, there's another um, Mexican dude down there that me and him we talk all the time, and I love practicing my Spanish. And then we got um, a couple of Portuguese couples here. Some of them are from Brazil. Some of them are from Portugal. And uh, one of them's a teacher, and another one is a a uh, family physician. And everyone here in the complex that we live in complains that, you know, why, why can't we own a house? It's not like we don't have the money or the credit to buy a house. It's not that. And the people that are chewing me out saying it's Vancouver's not for white people or Vancouver's not for poor people, um, you're wrong. It's, it's not that. It's not that we don't have the money, Mr. Chu or Mr. Lee, and that are trashing me. It's not you guys. It's not because we we, we don't want. It's not that we can't get the money. It's the problem is we don't want to spend the money. We're not stupid. And that's what I'm trying to say. And then you're commenting on my weight and I'm a retarded. I think buying a house for two, three million dollars and hoping that it goes up in price is more retarded than not being able to read like me. I think not being able to read like me, I'd rather prefer being like this and doing as well as I do in life as opposed to buying a $3 million house thinking, you know, and Donald Trump said it. And when I went to one of his, one of his seminars, the best business deal you'll, you could ever do or some of the best, best, best business deals that you could do are the ones you don't do at all. And it makes a lot of sense. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Comment below and haters, please. Stop trashing me. I ban people from the channel. And, the, and then one person messaged me, well, if you keep banning people, you're not going to have subscribers. I don't give a shit if I don't have subscribers. You think I'm here to uh, <laughs> to make money off YouTube or something? You think I'm here to look good or something? I don't look good. I'm fat. I'm here just to, you know, gospel, just to talk, you know? Just to talk and stop trashing people. It's not going to help the crisis. The prices will go down and the prices are going to keep going down. This is just the tip of the iceberg right here. This conspiracy newspaper that fell from the heavens down to my feet, made out of, uh, I think it's made out of uh, marijuana paper, made out of marijuana, so it's 100% conspiracy. So, anyways, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and uh, ciao.